If you have lot of worksheets in your workbook and you want to protect or unprotect all of them, then you can use the macro code which I am going to demonstrate and explain you line by line in this video. So stay tuned. Hi, I am your tutor and welcome to my channel Learn in 5 Minutes. So let's start. Here in my workbook, I have few of the worksheets and I need to protect them all. But if I go by conventional manner, then I will have to protect each of these sheets one by one, which will be a bit time consuming. And the same will be the case if I want to unprotect all sheets. So to do this, we will use a small VBA macro code. So let's open our VBA editor by pressing Alt F11. In this window, we will write our code. Since I have the code already copied in clipboard, I will just paste it here which will help us in reducing the video length. This is the macro code that will do our job. I have also provided this code in the description box below. Now let us understand this code line by line. The first line here is just a comment for us to better understand what our macro is supposed to do. Then we have started our macro with name protect all sheets. You can give any name you prefer to. Here in this line we have declared a variable ws which will be referred as worksheet further in this code. We have declared another variable password as string which will store our password. Later we have stored a string pass123 in our password variable which we have declared above. You can change this password according to your choice. This password will be used to protect our worksheets and you will need the same password when you want to unprotect them. Further we have started a loop which will run through all worksheets and within loop we have protected each sheet with password which we have provided above. Lastly, we have closed our loop with next ws and finally closed our macro with end sub. Ok, now let us copy this entire code and paste it again below and modify the function name from protect to unprotect. And change the action here from protect to unprotect. As a result of this, now we have two macro functions. One will protect all the sheets and other will unprotect them back. Now since we are done with our code, let's close this VB editor and return back to our excel sheet to test our macro code. To run our code, we need to press Alt F8. This will open the macro dialog box. You can see our both macro code names are available here. Before we execute this macro, have a look at the sheets. These are all unprotected. Now let us run our macro to protect these sheets. Just click on the name and hit run. You can see here below all our worksheets are now password protected. Now let us run our other macro which will help us to unprotect these sheets back. And we have successfully unprotected all our sheets. So that's all in this video. If you found this video useful, please like and share with your friends. And if you have not subscribed to this channel, do it right now and press the bell icon besides the subscribe button so that you don't miss on any new videos that I upload. Thanks for watching.